Hi, I'm Derek Clayton, and welcome to V Games, where we get to play dumb games and laugh at each other looking stupid. Today's guest is Kelsey Davies. No. Why am I talking like I'm selling cars? Because you are. But no. I'm selling you cards. 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 That's right, Garrett. Introducing Tower of Tarot, the game where you are tasked with building a towering masterpiece solely out of tarot cards. Here's how it works. Each player will get five minutes to build their tower, but here's the challenge. You must build while circling the table and never stand in front of our state-of-the-art oscillating fan that is trying to knock you down. And if that wasn't enough, you'll also be facing interview questions. And if you can't answer within five seconds, your opponent will topple your tower. Good luck. Three, two, one. What do you think my red flags are? Oh my gosh. Four. Answer the question. What do you think my red flags are? Um, three. You're too nice. You're too nice. And you're very charming. And green flags. Those are green flags. Oh, oh. Um, you, uh, yeah. Rush me. You rush me when That's I'm right. what trying are to build what are red this flags? tower. Um, you, <laughs> Ah, uh, you see into my soul. Describe uh, each of the following in two words or less. The internet. Oh. For Damaging, mm -hmm. uh, e educational. Instagram. Oh my gosh, ah, oh, I keep forgetting I'm Four, supposed to move. three, ah! um, two. Uh, fake, fake. <laughs> one. Uh, oh God. Keep going. Oh my God, I'm TikTok. not fun. Two TikTok. words or less. Fun and uh, in the sun. <laughs> Short. LinkedIn. Um, uh, linked and in. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Kanye West. Oh, outspoken and um, awoken. I think I got a method going on here. Is that how you're gonna make it really tall? Yeah, <laughs> it's. <laughs> <laughs> Slowly oh, but surely, it's getting there. It's going to get there. What do you think no. the opposite sex notices about you first? Ooh, tits. Oh, and, okay. And uh, in my dazzling smile. To be fair, you have great tits and a beautiful smile. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> my tits made me nervous. What do you notice first about the opposite sex? Um, Their, their smile, their teeth, mm -hmm. and... Their aura, actually, because <laughs> I'm a weirdo and this is not working. What do you think your red flags are? Ooh, that I uh, see dead people. That's a green flag to me. That I um, can see into the future, and if you're cheating on me, I will know. What do you think your green flags are? I'm very, very nice. I'm you very, are. very gen genuine. I'm probably the least judgmental person you'll ever meet because I'm such a weirdo. Oh, Two minutes wow, left. This is just, <laughs> ah! I think you can take your time building. I can. Yeah. Oh. This all this whole thing just it's happened just in three like, minutes. There's so many things. You got it. Happening I in my in life you. right you now. You can do it. I think yeah. they need words of encouragement from the spirits. I think so too. Spirits, oh. please guide me. If people came with a warning label, what would yours say? Besides, I see dead people. Um. A warning label. Like I can tell you, mine would be gassy. Oh yeah. Oh IBS. Yeah. Lactose intolerance. I guess. Oh, you're, I didn't know you're lactose intolerant. I am. I like really. I've sh myself like too many times to count. What's your favorite sh yourself story? Um, there was one time. I think it was a sign from the universe when I was driving to um, my ex's house and I was at a red light and I had Subway and I had uh, cookies mixed with Sprite. And then I sh my pants in the car. <laughs> nice. What do you think mine would say? But you can't say gassy because I already said it. Um, sinister. Look at that smile. <laughs> sinister. And, um, oh, ah! <laughs> and whenever we go out, you get recognized like every two seconds. So oh, there's no. no privacy. You did it! Ah, wait. Let's see how tall it is. Does it like count this way too? Here, I'll block the fan. That was like really hard. We have uh, four and a half inches. Good job, Kelsey. It's a good size. It's like average, right? Or now, is that above average? I think average is five. Is it? Yeah. Oh, I'm below average, darn it. Well, I mean, if we're talking about what I think we're talking oh, about. Oh, yeah. I'm, I know, I was talking about cars. I don't know where your mind was going. So you weren't talking about penises? Oh, no, I would never. I don't know what a penis is. Round two. Are you ready? Three, two, one action. What are you most likely to be frugal with? Frugal with yes. food. Not because I don't want to eat a lot of it. I just want, I want it to stay in my life. So I always want, I, that's why I meal prep. 
That way I can have the most, most, the most food possible. Yes, okay, what is the best gift that you have ever received? The best gift I've ever received is a, uh, my, Three? I'm not religious, but my great grandmother gave, or my great grandpa gave me my great grandma's rosary, and oh. I'm not religious, but I love her, and I know she was, and I know how much that meant to her, so oh. I felt, felt that really was nice. sweet. I love that. Okay, <laughs> would you rather be the best player on an awful team or the worst player on a great team? I'd rather be the worst of the best than the best of the worst. Yes. Okay. What subject matter do you think you are most qualified to give advice about? Um. Ugh. I'm the most qualified to give advice on, um, oh God. Three. Oh no. Two. Um, I can give the best advice on making chicken in a glass pan. Okay. What am I most qualified to give advice about? You are the most qualified to give advice. Oh my God. So on, um. Three. I think you're very honest in a kind way. And I think you're, you would be good at like teaching people how to like, Lead with honesty without hurting your feelings. Oh, we love honesty. What is your favorite smell besides your own farts? Cookie dough. Okay, cookie dough. How would you describe how I smell using as much detail as possible? You, to me, would smell like spirit essence. Is it like the good kind or the bad kind? Because some demons smell like sulfur, you know? Like, I don't want to smell like rotten. No, egg. I don't think you smell like sulfur. I think you smell like, um, I mean, you always smell nice to me. You, you've been smoking a lot less weed recently, so you don't smell like weed anymore. I love that. That's good. <laughs> what is the dumbest thing you have done while intoxicated? Oh, that's a long list. Three. The dumbest thing I've ever done was... Ah! Ah! No! Zero. <laughs> what do you think my most annoying habit is? Your most annoying habit? Yeah. I don't know if you have, you know what? I love you, I'm really, you know I'm very allergic to cats. Your love of cats is annoying. <laughs> what mentors have had the most significant impact on your life? Um, it was when I did a play with Al Pacino and Judith Light, and they both taught me so much, not just about what I do as an actor or an entertainer, but also as like a person in the world who is living this like crazy life that they were like, yeah, you know, your life is, is different and that's okay. And, but it's about what you do with it that matters. Yes, absolutely. What do you think my most awkward tendency is? Your most awkward tendency? Yes. May, I would feel like it would be hard for you to like have spiritual, sp like ghost things happen and not want to like freak people out. Yeah. I don't, I'm not freaked out. I'm always excited when you talk about it, but that's why I don't want to pressure you and ask too many times. But what is the most uh, challenging thing that other for people to understand about you and why? Um, I'm goofy, but that doesn't mean I'm not like doesn't mean I'm stupid. It just means I, I want to have a good sense of humor, and I think people just like they confuse kindness for weakness. They confuse uh, joy for stupidity. Dang! I think I won. I don't think we even need to measure, guys. Thirteen. 13. 13. Wow. I had my thumb on the floor and everything. Oh, nephew. Here at one. I gotta give him this one. I do. We did good. Yeah, thank you for joining Garrett Viral Games. I'm not out of breath, and we'll see you on the next one. I can't tell you how many times I said, I'm Garrett Clayton, and you're watching Disney Channel. I'm Garrett Clayton. So, I still said the thing. Yeah. <laughs> that's good. I was <laughs> like, that's enough for me. This is Ah. Poor Disney Channel. They're really struggling now. Hello.